Yo, how you doing? Now that I have a bike sponsor, it's finally time for me to do my first ever bike check video. Absolutely right, bike check video. Me and Benito are actually out at a secret place exploring some spots. And as the location is pretty nice, I figured out bike check video would be nice. All right, so we're starting off with a bike. This is also Benicta's bike. That's, by the way, Mafia Bike sent Benicta her very own 18 inch Mad Main in green fuel. Same as me. All right, how should we do this? Um, do you want to hold the camera? Yeah. Nah, I'm good. All right, so what about just starting with the most important? It's a Mafia Bike hit main 20.8 inches green fuel, as you can see. The green fuel color is seriously the craziest ever color I've ever had on a bike. And it looks even more ridiculous in the sun. One of the things I enjoy the most about this frame is the super short back end. Having a short back end on your bike allows you to spin so much faster than if you have a bike with a longer chainstay. And it's not only a little bit faster, a loads faster. I swear I will never ever ride a long back end again in my life. Moving on to the bars, we got the Mafia bike hit main. This color is so sick. From this side, it looks like yellow slash greenish. But if you move to the other side, it's, it's freaking blue and purple. All the eye grips, soon to be replaced. These things are beaten up. Mafia bike hit main stem, top load. Absolutely love the top load stem because it makes the, makes the bars taller and it make, kind of makes the, the bike feel more responsive. I used the headset that came with the frame, it's the FSA. Moving on to the tires, we got Demolition Momentum, my absolute favorite front tire. It's very fat and bulky, it feels very solid. If you jump like a big set of stairs, you, need, you, you want to have like a solid front tire. Hit main forks in 27 millimeter offset. I like to have the short offset just due to, yeah, nose mammals. Everything you do on the front wheel just feels so much easier. Profile mini front hub with one tie bolt and one steel bolt on the peg side just to have some, just for more strength. A hub guard that's sort of cut in half. <laughs> to be 100% honest with you, I don't really know what the pegs are. So the pegs will be anonymous. Absolutely right, that's my time lapse setup. This is pretty cool. I run a BSD fat seat, and that's pretty much because if I slip the pedals on upper whips, I will have something soft to land my ass on. The bullet brake mod on the Mafia bike looks insane. You can mount your brake in there, make, it will make it more stiff, which means more brake power. Should do a little bike check for you too. Very dirty and very worn out stolen thermalite pedals. It's a BSD something something crank, I, I have no idea the name. Eclat 26 tooth sprocket. Moving on to the back, we got a profile mini back hub, which is a slightly different color than the front. If you can see, this is more like orange. That color is like more gold. Yes, something messed up. Let me tell you a little something about my rims. This is a G Sport rib cage rim. And it's seriously the best rim that I ever had before. I've been riding this rim with like multiple spokes broken and wheel is still going strong. That's pretty incredible. I have no idea of the spokes. And as same as on the front, I got one titanium bolt and one steel for extra strength on the peg side. Super worn out, hub guard. And the last and probably least 
a Maxxis Grifter tire in the back, which is 1.90 wide. Yep, that's pretty thin. Let me tell you a little something about my bike. All right, so the reason I ride, I ride a very, very skinny tire in the back. Reason is it rolls faster. It's less rubber rolling on the ground, meaning it's less resistance. Left hand drive, because I like to catch whips. Grip tape on the crank arm for not sliding up when doing whips. That's a very, very important detail on my bike. All right, so you've probably seen this pair, this extra slice of grip that I have on my bars next to my grip. Why do I have that weird little rubber thing there? The reason is, when I do bar spins, I don't hold like this. I hold like this. I need to hold my finger onto the edge of the grip to do to guide the bars around. So yeah, this thing is for comfort when doing bar spins. All right, so that is gonna be it for this video. My first ever bike check. I hope you liked it. This bike is seriously the best bike I've ever ridden. Every single trick just feels unbelievably smooth with the geometry and everything. So yeah, thank you very much for watching through this whole video. And if you liked it, I would definitely appreciate if you would press the like button on this video. If you want to see more of our content, you should also subscribe and press the bell to get a notification every single time we drop a video so you don't ever miss out. Go out and ride, see you in two days. <laughs>